Okay, today I wanted to talk about this breakthrough I had about two weeks ago, I suppose, and it's in hindsight of my 21 day traumatic quarantine experience where I stayed 21 days in a hotel quarantine with my 10 year old. And coming out of that and then having my 50th birthday celebration, I seem to get some bad self body image um, mantras going in my mind. Things I would glare at in a reflection or a mirror and just be disappointed in myself and just not like. And I would, you know, just have these thoughts that would just run through and it became this pattern. Until about two weeks ago, it was uh, the end of a yoga session where you, you lay in stillness and allow your body time to reacclimate all the the movements you've done and the flows you've done in yoga. And in that quietness, you usually are talked through to relax parts of your body, um, usually from the head down. And I found myself in that moment telling myself, I love my face. Better yet, I love my eyes because I'm seeing how they're getting more sunken in and getting that more mature look. I love my nose. It's always been a feature that stood out to me that I probably liked least about myself. Um, my skin, that I love my skin. And basically just I love me. But going through each part of the body and especially the ones that were sticking points. And in those moments to say it, Sometimes once was enough, sometimes I had to repeat it several times. And I tell you, after working all the way through my body, and as intimate details as you want to, because it's just you, be honest with yourself, and release love into every part of your body. And it's been two weeks now, and still when I talk about it, I get this mushy feeling. It really impacted me and really released some love back into myself. And I think we can all use that given the, our situation with COVID and what's going on in the world, um, our relationships. I think when we start coming at all of these outside angles from a better place within, of course, we're going to have more beauty. We're going to have more joy. We're going to have better relationships, more love to share. Another point on this topic is I did a singing bowl session with a friend of mine. And I was the participant and the receiver on the receiving end. And so these vibrations help to reset um, the molecules and have an impact. And I know to some of you that seems very airy fairy, new agey, but I've been looking into it and just thinking, you know, our natural world and what we're made up of, just taking it more seriously and really giving thought to it. Water is important, the vibrations in our universe, it all comes into play and not to mention the words we release over ourselves and the thoughts we allow to release over ourselves. Just want to leave you with those thoughts and I'll follow this up with a breathwork segment where we go through and do exactly what I just said, release love into every part of the body. Until next time, I love you guys. Bye.